So welcome back to the grind. Hopefully we're doing very, very well. We are here on Sand River on a beautiful Friday. So we're all looking forward to the weekend. And my team is uh, going like 50-50, north and south, which is interesting. I mean, the Conqueror going north is a little bit worrying. I wouldn't really take a Conqueror north, but we're going to go down the middle and we'll see if we can get some quick spots on anyone that is pushing the middle over this side here. There is someone here, as you can see. Uh, we do not pen. We might be able to get another shot off though in a second. He goes forwards a little bit. I shoot. I should be able to shoot through this, I think. Uh, maybe not actually. But I should be able to spot him if he comes here. There we go. Very nice. Very, very nice indeed. He had a lot of fun. Put one into his capola. And we can just genuinely be quite annoying. Um, the only problem is that there is a lot of people in the middle of the map. And artillery is wanting to shoot me. Which is, uh... Well, not very nice, really, is it? Just try and hide our... Our Capola. Oh, I wanted to try and get a, um... I wanted to try and get another tracking shot on this guy, if I could. This is really not good, by the way. Like, really, really not good. Uh, yeah. I mean, I hope that we do. There's a Udes 1516 that is camping at the back of the map. Lovely. I mean, this isn't absolutely awful, but it's not very good. Please don't high roll. Thank you. I mean, he has 440 alpha, so I really didn't want him to high roll there. Um, I'm just worried about artillery now, honestly. Like, that's the one thing that's going to be really, really annoying for me. Uh, artillery's been spotted, though, so... I mean, we should be okay. There we go. Finish him off. Now, can I get up here and then maybe shoot the Yudas? I'm not sure if that one went in or not. A little bit hard to tell. Uh, I shouldn't be shot by the 50 TP, so we should be safe from that. Well, thank you. Okay, now that that side's dead as well. I mean, it worked for our team going like 50-50, I guess. Can we just ignore you? I want another shot on this guy. Unfortunate. I mean, everyone's been spotted, so... Let's just go up this way. I want to see if I can get a shot on this T10. Where are you going? Okay, very interesting. Oh, we get 3k out of it. Very, very nice. Not too bad, considering they all rushed us. And we kind of ply it as we are now well on our way to getting the M103. I mean, we only need 168k, which is not too bad, to be honest. Um, 
but it shouldn't take us too long to unlock the M103. Obviously, I'm going to be free marking this thing. Um, but yeah, the M103, it shouldn't take us too long to get that. And then we can move on to field mods, which is going to help out this tank a lot. Well, here we are on Abbey. Wonderful. Oh, I cannot wait to ban this map in the next patch. <laughs> Actually, I'm not going to be banning this map on, on this account for the next patch because I won't get World of Tanks Plus on this account. Oh well. <laughs> I guess we're still playing it on this account. Uh, I, this map, it's not the worst, which is why it's not banned. But like, it's just... There's nothing to really do. You can't... There's no flanking opportunities. There's no like... It's very stagnant and stale is what it is. So, that's the reason why I don't like it. And the reason why a lot of people don't like it. It's not just me. A lot of my uh, friends don't like this either. So, yeah, Abbey's a bit of a stinker of a map, to be honest. But, let's see if we can get a free shot on anyone that is crossing over this way early on. We might be able to. M6Y is there. There we go. Lovely. Playing against IS3 and an IS5. I'm not really too fussed about these two, to be honest. I can go hold down here. T103 scares me a little bit, I won't lie. That is a scarier tank to uh, face off against. But as long as we can go and hit his Capola, we'll be absolutely fine. And as long as we hide our Capola, this is not the This is not the play, Mr. Uh, phase one. Trying to get the overmatch on the uh, IS3, but it's not happening. I mean in four seconds I can kill this. But he's gonna shoot him and that's fine. I'm gonna struggle against this phase one, I think. I'm going to need more pen than uh, what I have. This guy, like in the phase one, I appreciate that he's trying to help, but he is just dying. Like... <laughs> How good's your repair? I mean, you have a built-in track repair, so you should have pretty decent repair time. Yeah, T-103 is going to be a dodgy one for me to deal with. I need to try and deal with this phase one if I can. Nice. I'm going to repair that track, though. That's absolutely fine here. Nice. I'm gonna make sure that I can now kill this guy. Okay. To be fair, I actually shouldn't have even done that. I just blocked my own team for no reason. Like the Lorraine would have killed him. I should have just ignored the phase one. Nice. This is going very well. I can now actually go forwards and try and kill this IS-3. Mm. That was a bad shot, to be fair. I didn't need to rush it. There was no reason to rush the shot. There we go. And now we venture forth and hit this guy's Capola. Well, at least the Jagdpunk was good. <sighs> nice. 3.9k. Very, very good. I don't think that's enough for an ace. Um, I think we need to get maybe like one more kill or something. But like the, the games recently, I don't know why, but they have been like unbelievably fast. Also, I don't think the uh, AMX is going to go up, because I think he'll get spotted, so I reckon he's going to go around this way. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, all right, well, there you go. We kill a tier nine. We didn't get the second tier nine, but that's that's decent. It is enough for an ace. Not bad. Apply. 12,000 XP. Very, very good. Well, at least we don't have to get the mastery on this tank anymore. How many games have we played? We played eight games at 2.1. And 87%, 88% win rate. Anyway, on to our third and final game. Well, here we are on Pearl River. It is against tier 9s once again. Honestly, this tank doesn't care that it's meeting tier 9s. The only problem is the pen. I mean, yeah, I would say that the, the tank doesn't care about meeting tier 9s. But, okay, right, I'm not going this way. I'm going to the middle of the map. That is completely useless. Like, all of our heavies have gone to the middle instead of actually, and this guy's AFK. Like, I'm not going this side and just dying for nothing. So I'm going to go to the mid, and we're probably going to end up losing this game now. But, you know, you, you never know. This guy doesn't even want to push. Well, I... Pff. The games recently have just been very... What is going on? I, do, I genuinely do not understand the games that have been happening recently that I've had. Mm, mill 2 is going to be a problem for me. I'm not going to repair and repair or medkit that. Oh look, a Vipera that I just cannot pen. It's lovely. You know it's bad when they'll have more chance of putting a mill two than the uh, Viper. <laughs> uh, well, I don't really know what to do in this scenario, to be honest. Um, hmm. Yeah. Um. I see. Ah, our E seventy five has woken up though. Can I go up this? I can't remember. I, I'm pretty sure I need a lot more speed than that. Yeah, this is going to be a loss, probably. Not a lot I can do against this. I can just try and get as much damage as I can on this guy, I suppose. I mean, he's firing APCR though, so I stand a chance against him. Also, this Vipera is pushing up as well. I mean, I'll get a little bit of damage out of this game, it's fine. I'm not, I'm not expecting loads though, like the TNH is coming behind me right now as well. Who's going to come and say uh, bonjour? Look at him go. To track him, he's firing HE. The f the problem is with his hate with his HE is that he can actually pen the side of me with that. However, frontally, good luck, my friend. And I'm going to track him again. And do you have a repair crew? I mean, you do, sort of. But. I can just do this, and um, yeah, you're not looking so uh, great now, are you, Mr. Vibera? No, no, you're not. Did you enjoy that? Hmm. I don't know why you would fire HE at me, but there you go. There's no way I can shoot that. Right, moving on. can track him. He's not got any shots though. I mean this didn't turn out awful in the end. It's a lot better than I thought it was going to go. 
Now, does the Centurion go back up or does he try and go across? I don't even know if I'm going to be able to spot him if he goes across. He goes across. Because that's the logical thing to do. <laughs> well. Ooh. I was going to say, now I want to go up. But actually, I'm just going to go over this way. I'm going to go and spot this guy. Can I get a shot on this guy's Capola? Hmm. Not really. I have a feeling the Centurion's going to come back. <laughs> you know, sometimes you can just predict these things. It's just, it's just... You just... You just know. I'm now going to push down into here so that he has to then overpeak if he wants to shoot me. And then at that point, he tries to overpeak. He should die. Um, so, very nice. Yeah. This was a very good game, actually. Maybe I can finish this guy off? Unless someone else is going to shoot him in a second. Very, very nice indeed. What was that? Two, two tier 9s killed in that game? No, three tier 9s actually. I killed nearly all the tier 9s. Very nice. And then, back to back masteries. Uh, one day we'll get all three masteries in a row. Apply. Look at that. Wonderful. So did we, how many did we kill? We killed the, the TNH, the Centurion and the Emil. Yeah, I nearly killed every single tier 9. No, no, I didn't need to kill the other. No, that's the tier 9 max. This is the tier 8. So I killed two out of the four tier 9s. That was 1.5k base. Well, a successful... Oh, Jesus. A very successful episode. We gained 30,000 XP in three games. With nearly 4,000 average damage. <laughs> I don't know. I Look, I don't know what's going on in this tank, okay? It's a good tank. It's just, you need to get the right matchup for it. We're just lucky that the enemy played like idiots. This is what I mean by the games have been really, really weird recently. Like, my team played like idiots, the enemy team played like idiots. It's just, that's not how you play the game. I don't understand. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you did enjoy. Hopefully you have a very good weekend. And I'll see you all in the next one, on Monday. <laughs> see you later.